That's a cop. It's a cop. Not good. Oh shit, he's gonna blow up. <laughs> well, he killed everybody else for us. Welcome back, everybody, to Seven Days to Die. I'm an old guy gaming, and this is the Wasteland Survival Series, where we play this game on the same difficulty zones. are all set to nightmare speed. We play on a map that is almost entirely made up of wasteland biome, generated by the nitrogen world map generator. And we just got our asses handed to us uh, in the last episode, if you didn't catch that. So, uh, basically, what we're trying to do, or what we were trying to do until we epically failed, is work our way through uh, the... the... the daycare, nursery, whatever the hell this place is called. And uh, we got up to the second floor and we just got owned by uh, uh, an irradiated biker and an irradiated uh, frickin' uh, one of the other idiot zombies, the spastic guy. So anyway, um, what we're doing now is we're just basically on a recovery mission to get our shit back. And then I'm probably gonna, you know, we, we hose the mission, but I'm still gonna probably at least uh, try and get up to the roof so we can get the fat loots at the end of the tunnel. And so it's not a complete loss. So, uh, yeah, we were basically, you know, I went, I, I re resurrected back at the base. Let's just get rid of that for now. And got, you know, some basic supplies to come back here and work our way back through to get to our stuff. So that's our first order of business. Now, hopefully we don't have a bunch of repops on the bottom floor here. Because if we do, then shit, that's going to suck. So let's just move on through here. It's looking like it's probably going to be. Uh, relatively clear on the first floor, which is good. But yeah, those uh, those irradiated bikers, man, they are just no joke. And I'm still, offensively, I'm pretty weak uh, at this point in time, just because I've been putting most of my points into intellect, you know, so I can make the motorcycle and work towards a 4x4 and a couple. And I've also been putting a bunch of skills, or rather points into mining skills. And so, you know, I, I'm just a little feel like I'm just a little bit um, behind in terms of my offensive skill for, for doing these quests at our current game stage. Okay, so there's our stuff. And yeah, I just uh, I completely got my ass handed to me in the last episode. And it, you know, it was, it was my own fault, of course. It always is, but... It just, uh, it was tough. Things didn't go so well for us. All right, so let's um, put our good stuff back on in terms of armor. I'm going to I'm gonna keep the, let's put the luckies on too. I'm going to keep the, um, the steel boots on though, uh, just so we're just a tiny bit tougher. And then let's get our normal weapons back in place here. I'm going to keep the Magnum, I think, in the second slot. Just for a little extra firepower. And then if, if we have a chance to do a stealth shot, then we will uh, do so. Okay. And what else do we want to do here? Let's put these down here for now. Okay, well. Let's check these while we're here. Did we look at that already? Yeah, we did. I want to grab the brass off these sinks. Dying in this game just sucks so bad, and the reason it sucks is because of that stupid uh, uh, near-death trauma bullshit, whatever it's called. You know, because then you then you lose twenty-five. Well, you don't lose anything. You're basically what happens is you're. XP is put on hold, um, and you have to earn 25% of it back before you, you're back in business again, you know, before you're back to, to gaining XP, so it just really sucks. You know, I've got tons of pipes back at the base, so. Well, okay, I'll tell you what, since we are completely full, um, I'm thinking we should probably go back down and we're going to have to unload our extra stuff into the mini bike. We are still looking for... Uh, oh, shit. 
Yeah, it takes it takes way way too many bullets to kill these guys, and it's not it's it's my fault. It's not my fault. It's just where I'm at, right with my skills. I got somebody's attention. All right, we really looking for nerdies. Those aren't nerdies. This doesn't sound good. This does not sound good at all. Can we can we get in here? Oh, they can come through here too, can't they? Uh, all right. I need quickly. Where's my hammer? Too late. Come on, Edgar, just die. You feral bastard. You know, the other thing that occurred to me, too, is we are in the city and in the wasteland. So that probably... Oh, shit, we got a white. Are you kidding me? So I think that also... Is he dead? Yeah, okay. At least he wasn't a feral white. That also contributes to the nastiness of these Zeekers. See, even she's a frickin' uh, feral. And it's nighttime on top of that, in the wasteland. So, yeah, there you go. We might have to establish a new policy where we don't go after zombies in the wasteland at night. Until we are seriously decked out, which we are not. Decked out and leveled up. Let's just block those off. Okay, well, darn it. Um, I'm trying to figure out what the best course of action here is. If we should just press on. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't want to do that. You know what? We got too much shit. We just got too much shit. I'm not sure if there's going to be anything super good, you know, up in the, up in this attic or not. Really? I don't have room for one more shotgun shell. Can we, are we, oh, there we go. Now we do. <laughs> good thing I checked that, huh? All right. Is everything loaded? Hello? Nope. That was not fully loaded. I know we're supposed to be going back to offload, but I don't want to. Um, okay, so... Let's make some noise. I don't think anything can come up behind us. See if we can get someone's attention where we can shoot them from up down here. It's not working. I hear someone coming after us. Is that the door they're banging on? I can't really tell. Oh yeah, okay. So let's just let them break through. And we'll uh, take them out from here. It sounds like it's just one Zeker, though. Thing is, is I don't want to jump down there to kill her and then have something, you know, come out through there and get us. So we're just going to be... We're just going to be patient here. We're going to take it easy. Come on! Break that door open. Did we kill you? 
We did now. Oh man, okay. Okay. Good. So we just uh, took care of a couple of more booby traps. Uh, I want the paper for shotgun shells, but what are we going to give up for it? You know what? We need more healing, so let's take this now. And then we'll just scrap this. Find 10% more jewelry and precious gems when looting. Thank you very much. We will take that. We have lucky looters on now, right? I should probably have the goggles on instead. You know what? I'm probably going to forget to do this, but let's put these on just so we have a little more oomph with agility-based weapons. And then, um... That's worth a 160. We don't need that. We've got plenty of that for mining. We were going to eat this when we got here, so let's do that. That gives us another spot back. Uh, all right, so this is just back out here, right? Yeah, okay. Paper and paper. That looks like it's a... A thing. No, we don't want that stuff. Okay. There could be Zeke's up there, but I think that was probably those two businessmen that dropped down earlier. Maybe. That sounds like an easy, also known as a crawler. Oh, man, we already know that. Uh, what's that worth? 160. Yeah. Uh, 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 uh. Now what do we do? Shit. Oh, we do have one space left. Never mind. Table saw. Apparently we already know that. I didn't know that we already knew that, but we do. Oh, now what? Now we are truly out of space. This, I've got a few back at the base. It's only worth nine coin. Let's get rid of it. Come on, luckies. Nope. All right, scrap that. Um, I would like to take those. Well, you know what we can do? At, at, the, at least we'll scrap them. So at least we get the scrap from them. I'm not sure where that's coming from. Oh yeah, I remember this room. We look, looked through there earlier. Shut up, easy. Let's close that for a minute. Okay. Whew. All right, so this is going to get us up on the roof. Oh, we're getting a decent amount of paper out of this place. I don't care about that. Doors open. What the hell, man? There's nothing behind there.
what we'll do is we'll finish it out and then we'll we'll just put uh we'll we'll just go back down and, and nerd pull up to get all the rest of the stuff. That's what we'll do. Now last time we were up here we had an irradiated biker. Okay, so let's do this. Um There's an irradiated something over there. Oh shit. I didn't think that was enough to um That's a cop. It's a cop. Not good. Oh shit, he's going to blow up. <laughs> well, he killed everybody else for us. Or not everybody else, but most everybody else. Phew! Okay. I don't know where this other Zeker is. Let's just put that in there for a minute and see if she'll come around and have our junk turret take her out. That, actually, that cop blowing up worked in our favor because it killed the other zombies for us. Nothing wrong with that, man. Um, here, let's go ahead and... Yeah. I wouldn't mind getting the bones for glue, but... Actually, I'd rather have the bones right now... ...than the rotten meat. At some point, I do want to do a garden, though, at some point. We might have to wait until we do a respec before we can do that, though. It didn't quite gain us another spot. Okay, well, let's go. Wherever that Zeker is, it seems to be hung up on something. Are they down below? Where the hell are they at? I don't know. Yeah, they must be down below. Okay, well, let's check this real quick. Scrap a doodle and take a doodle in reverse order. We need to be able to get our um, our junk turret. Where in the world those zombies are, but let's do this. Let's at least put that there. We're gonna we're gonna have to go back down that way because I don't have a nerd. Wait, do I have a nerd pull up here? I don't think so. No. Yeah, we're gonna have to go back down through the building anyway. So, all right. Well, let's take a look and see what we got here. Oh, that's a nice find. I was gonna say I thought I heard her up here. Frail nurse. Is that an easy? Hmm. Okay. Let's check these. Shamway and a shoddy messiah. Oh man, we got rid of one of those earlier. Okay, that's that's good stuff. All right, let's put a couple of things in here just so we can free up some space and get these guys looted. I want that bunker buster for sure. Hey, easy. Feral easy. All right, so let's see. We got, uh, we still got lockpicks. 
Yeah, who'd have thunk a tier two fight would have been this hard? But again, it's not so much that it's tier two, it's that A, we're in the wasteland at nighttime, and B, I have a pretty high game stage, and C, my gun skills suck. <laughs> so, all those things together are working against us for sure. Fortifying grip mod, that's nice. Uh, let's just put that... All of my hand tools are shitty level ones right now, but they are steel. Uh, so we'll just put this on here for now, if for no other reason, just to free up a slot. Um, that's probably worth selling, and that's definitely worth selling. But that was kind of shitty loot, though, all, all told. Not gonna lie, it kind of sucked. Okay, well, um, we definitely want that, we definitely want those, we want that. I want the leather, I want the tea, and the paper. Um, yeah, I guess I'll come back for that stuff. The thing is, is I'm going to have to make, um, I'm going to have to make two trips now because I can't get my mini bike back. I can't pack it up because it's, we're going to have to put stuff in its inventory. So that being said, I mean, yeah, it doesn't really matter, I guess. But let's leave this here. Uh, you know what? Screw it. I don't want to have to come back up to the roof. Screw it, screw it, screw it. Pick that up. All right, let's go. What's this? Did they just break a hole in the wall there? They must have. Huh, interesting. Yeah, we better we better be careful about um doing quests in the wasteland at nighttime. So I think that's just asking for trouble. Mineral water? Nope. Lucky looters? Nope. Don't need a poncho. That's good stuff. Alright, we'll have to come back for that too. Uh, and let's grab the, let's grab the leather off this couch. Where's my axe? Where's my axe? There it is. Oh, wait, we don't want to go this way. We came in through the back here. Through here, right? Where do we come in at? Over here? Yeah. Okay, well, um... So we're all full up here. Is there anything, though, that we can combine? Sometimes it's quicker just to do a shift-click, see what'll go in there, than try to find it with your eyeballs, you know? Okay, we got- we made a couple of spots. All right, so that means then, is there anything in here? That means we could pick up the mini bike and then take three more things in addition to that back with us and not have to come back here for now. I'm feeling kind of lazy, I'm not gonna lie, so I think that's what we're gonna do. I mean, there, there's nothing else that we left in there that's absolutely critical that we take with us anyway. There really isn't. Um, in fact, we could ditch that for now kind of want to hang on to that because we can make chili dogs we can ditch that uh we can scrap both of these things because i've got stacks and stacks of this shit back at the at the ranch so that frees us up a, a little i don't care about this so let's scrap that uh, 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 uh okay so that gains us some more space back so let's put um some more items in here Okay, cool. Maybe we can get everything we need now. Gotta love that inventory management. Alright, where was the room? It was all the way up in the front here. We left something in here. What was it? Yeah, that stuff. I want that stuff. 
Did we check in here? Yeah, that's where we got the satchel. Okay, and then we can just got a few things up on the roof to what we gotta grab. Um, where was that hole next to the stairs? Here. There we go. Yeah, I know, you're tired. Okay, we want all that. Um, nine pieces of paper instead of 20 bones. Yeah, I guess we'll do that. Let's eat that. Why not? Okay. We could try and wrench that, but I don't think I'm going to. Um, yeah, I don't think I'm going to do that, so. Okay, guys, well, I guess that's it for now. Uh, for this this place anyway that's too bad we failed the damn quests it makes me think we're probably not going to be able to earn thirty-six thousand coin before the trainer resets to buy those uh four by four parts which kind of sucks but you know it is what it is we'll we'll eventually get it one way or the other but the main reason i want the four by four again is Storage space A and B, it it just it's a better vehicle for moving through the wasteland because you know it can bust through everything except for the actual you know brick blocks. It can bust through the center blocks and the and the metal, you know, the scrap iron. The other thing we should really be considering though is that I mean I can um I can make the gyrocopter now. I actually can. And we could actually take that and fly back to our prison base and get some of our more valuable stuff from there. And do it in relative safety because, you know, we'd be flying. So that's something I need to really consider too. And I, I don't even remember everything that I have back at that base. I mean, I know we've got some weapons and we've got some ammo that would be useful to get. And ammo, you know, gunpowder and probably some mods and things like that. So I will think about that. I'll give it some thought and see if that makes sense to, for us to do right now. Um, but I still want, eventually, I still want to get the 4x4. I just do. I think that's going to really help us. Blech. But I am happy, you know, that I don't have to go uh, all the way up to, to level 9 in intellect just to get the gyrocopter because now we can make it, which is pretty cool. Pretty darn cool. Okay, well, we can't go to the trader right now. Uh, he doesn't open until six, a little after six. And I do need some. I need some more stone to to continue making concrete. So, I think, guys, what I'm gonna do is I think I'm gonna just wrap up this episode a little bit earlier than I normally would because it's there's just not really we don't really have enough time left. For me to start something else. Um, so yeah, let's do that. Yeah, so what I'm going to do is... I'm going to think about whether or not I want to make the gyrocopter now. There really isn't a good reason not to. I mean, we're going to have to make a little more steel. But I mean, that's easy peasy now that we got the crucible. So I think what I'll do is I'll make the gyrocopter. Uh, I'll, I'll take... You know, I'll get the next quest going from the trader. Uh, once he opens up... And um, probably go mine some more stone so I can just keep working on getting my base finished up. Because I want to get this finished. Uh, so I can, you know, continue to, you know, get the XP from the building and all that sort of thing. And, and, and just to get it finished, you know. And then when we come back the next episode, we might go on a trip in the gyrocopter back to our prison base and get our shit from there. That's kind of what I'm thinking we'll probably do. I'm thinking it's going to be very difficult for me to raise 36,000 coin in the next two days, you know, to buy the, the 4x4 parts from him. So that's not likely to happen. Um, I mean, 
we could make steel and sell that to him. That, nah, that's not worth it. That's just not worth it. Because that's 760 for the whole damn stack. That's Yeah, that's just not worth it. So yeah, I think that's it, guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you didn't hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, share out the video. Make sure you're staying safe from the coronavirus. I hope you guys are all staying very safe from that. That shit's getting scary, man. I'll tell you what. I'm not going to lie. It's a, it's a little bit disturbing. But all we can do is, you know, stay away from other people, hunker down, and hope for the best. And so I wish all of you um, safety, safety and wellness and all that during this uh, really crazy time in our world. And we will catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye.